Hi. If you would like to become a mammography technologist, Redcom can provide you with the tools you need to achieve your goal. Hello, my name is Jeanette, and I'm here to explain the steps necessary to become a mammography technologist. Mammography is the most regulated modality in radiology, so pay close attention to the details. I will explain the requirements of MQSA and the ARRT. First, let's begin with the FDA, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. The FDA is responsible for enforcing the MQSA, Mammography Quality Standards Act. MQSA regulates mammography equipment and personnel. It defines what is required of the technologist for initial training in mammography. In order to legally perform mammograms, you must fulfill these requirements. First, you must be ARRT registered. Second, you are required to complete at least 40 hours of documented training specific to mammography. The coursework must include instruction in breast anatomy and physiology, positioning and breast compression, quality assurance and quality control techniques, and imaging patients with breast implants. Three, you must perform 25 mammograms under the direct supervision of a qualified mammography technologist. And four, at least eight hours of training in mammography modality that you will be using, either screen film technology or fulfilled digital mammography. Click on the useful information link to learn more about digital training. Once you fulfill these requirements, they do not expire. If you would like to advance your career by becoming a mammography technologist, RADCOM can provide you with the necessary coursework to satisfy the initial training requirements. We recommend that you complete the courses in the initial training package since they were designed to provide important information you will need to successfully pass the ARRT mammography registry exam. Now I will cover the ARRT requirements for mammography technologists. You do not have to be ARRT registered in mammography to perform mammograms. However, the majority of facilities prefer that you are ARRT registered, but it is not required by law. Call the ARRT and request the Mammography Certification Handbook. You can also download the information from their website at ARRT.org. In order to become eligible for the ARRT post-primary mammography exam, first, you must be in compliance with MQSA requirements. Second, you must complete an additional 75 mammograms, screening and or diagnostic, and these do not have to be supervised. Three, you will also have additional clinical experience requirements, such as QC procedures, special procedures, review of at least 20 mammograms with a radiologist. You have a 24-month window in which to complete all these procedures before applying to the ARRT. Since RADCOM is devoted to your success, I've put together two valuable study tools to help you prepare for the ARRT registry exam. The first tool is a CD titled a Mammography Registry Review that includes over 700 slides in PowerPoint format. I arranged this according to the ARRT content specifications for the mammography exam. You will find five major content categories as outlined in the ARRT handbook. One, patient care, including education and assessment. Two, instrumentation and quality assurance. Three, anatomy, physiology, and pathology. Four, mammography technique and image evaluation. Five, breast imaging procedures. The second tool is a mammography mock registry exam containing 300 questions and answers in paragraph form. This is included in the initial training package and is also available as a PDF download. The two review products were designed to work together. We recommend that you first review all the content on the mammography registry review CD. Next. 
Test your skills with the mock registry exam. You will be able to identify areas in which you need more study before sitting for the actual board exam. RADCOM offers a complete package for initial mammography training. These courses fulfill the MQSA requirement and will prepare you for the ARRT mammography exam. The package contains 40 hours of coursework, second, the mammography registry review CD, and the mammography mock registry exam. If you require more information, you will find links to the FDA's MQSA regulations and the ARRT on this website. I hope you find the field of mammography as rewarding as I have found it to be. You will be saving women's lives one mammogram at a time. I wish you the very best and thanks again for turning to RADCOM for your mammography education needs.